Rwanda pamoja na Burundi hata pamoja na e, ndugu zetu wa Uganda hapa na tunataka tuipanue kwa njia inayo e, we are going to work with the private sector in that process but the port will not privatized i want us i want everybody to understand that the port will not be privatized we are going to work a concession process that is going to make sure that we protect the interests of kenya we protect the interests of the port but we work with the private sector to increase efficiency, to increase investment, and to make sure that the port serves more people, creates more jobs, and becomes much more efficient, and becomes much more broader and bigger. So mambo yale mengine blue economy mnaelewa vile nimetembea whole of uh, coast province kwa mambo ya blue economy the whole of uh, kule nyanza nilikuwa busia juzi kwa mambo ya blue economy we have a very clear plan on what we are doing good people mimi niliona nichukue nafasi hii ingawaje ndefu kidogo niwaeleze kwamba serikali mliochagua inafanya kazi sio kama tunaelewana eh inafanya kazi na mimi nataka niwahakikishie hii serikali itabadilisha taifa letu la Kenya i have no doubt in my mind that this is the administration that is going to change it to be tunaelewana jameni na nimetangaza waziwazi wazi. na mimi natangaza nataka nitangaze katika gongomano hili la watu wa national governing council ya UDA ya kwamba hatutaruhusu ufisadi sasa za taifa letu la Kenya hiyo haitafanyika na nimesema waziwazi wazi wacha nirudie kwa wakora wote na wezi na wale wa ufisadi mambo yao ni matatu mambo yao ni mangapi tunakubaliana hapo bas ya pili niliwaambia the reason why we are having this meeting is because of uh, three issues number one, i wanted to give you a report of the administration kama wana uda